everyone's chilling. Just watch, as soon as I pull out Rub Terra, some already know what I'm doing. Zipper! <laughs> the good stuff. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So today's video is gonna be about my mystery snail laying her eggs and how they hatched. Really exciting because I've honestly been wanting to like breed them for a while now. And um, I don't know if you guys saw my previous video or not. It was whenever one of my snails actually laid a clutch in one of the smaller tanks. And I tried the little container method and everything and I was gonna wait till they hatch, but never worked out. I don't know, I probably did it wrong, but it just, they just kind of molded. But after setting up this 20 gallon right here, which is pretty much my only snail tank, I'm going to add shrimp in the future. But for now on, I'm just growing water lettuce and breeding snails in there. The snails start laying eggs at the top and I kind of just left them and they hatched. Really cool, like I caught on video how she actually laid the eggs. So I'm gonna show that towards the end of the video. So stay tuned for that. And also just kind of let y'all know how I take care of them and, and stuff like that. I set the tank up all the way back in May. I have some footage from then. So I'm just gonna go ahead and play it right now. Hope y'all enjoy the footage. Hey y'all, so today is the day to finally set up the 20 gallon, but I first need to pack this tank away. I'm giving it back to my cousin and I'm going to be putting away this tank because I'm done using it for now. Hey y'all, just a little update here. I'm gonna show you what I've done so far. Put the 20 gallon here. This is where the corner tank used to be because I need to take all the tanks off this so we could um, put the support and everything. Um, it'll be here just temporary, but I do wanna just get it started. I will probably only put like this much water or something in um i just want to get the snails in here and everything and my plants and not wait too long and i have the corner tank right here i cleaned it out completely took out all the fish and plants i only left the dirt and i have all the media fish and snails in here at the moment with the filter going um this filter is actually gonna go into the 20 gallon i got a whole bunch of like supplies out this is the water i siphoned out but i'll update you guys once everything is set up build up halfway i think that's all i'm gonna do for now i'm going to put in the rest of the water lettuce in here and then i'm going to add the snails also masha came in here and she's taking a nap oh she kind of woke up but she's like pregnant pregnant So as soon as we finished packing up those two tanks and setting up the 20 gallon, we left the same night to visit Kentucky. We also took one of our chicks with us for our cousin Margarita and we are bringing back her betas. And then after a couple days we came home and the next morning that's when I found my snail laying her eggs. Alright guys, we're on the road. We still have like two and a half hours left. This is where the chick is staying. The fish are right there in the cooler. We got some stuff packed back there and gonna stop by a gas station soon, so. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys the chick. Holding him right now, he is in the box sleeping. Hey guys, so we made it to Margarita's and Rosa's house. We are setting up all the tanks right now. So we brought her some plants and her two betas. 
We'll update you guys tomorrow. <laughs> oh, my arm is so long. <laughs> oh. Tomorrow. Hey, buddy. Good morning, guys. It's the next day. Um, both betas are doing great. Now, uh, we finally got an extension cord, so Margo's gonna set up the filters. Don't rub it in. <laughs> <laughs> we are on our way back to Tennessee. We had to leave a day early because I decided to get the chicken box. Yeah, I planned it all along. Here, vlog. Is it played? Guys, look at my tan. We got to play. My first time sitting in the front on a road trip when there's three people, more than three people in the car. One hour late. Okay, so we just stopped at a gas station. Uh, we had to pour Julia water in her cup because we don't want to get it. But and we're also gonna pour her candy and her chips in a bag. Aww, let's get back on the road. Yeah. Okay. Bye. Update on my two boys. I still have mustard, believe it or not. He literally seems to be untreatable. He keeps biting at his fins, so they keep tearing. He's a big fin nipper, and his Popeye is like, at this point, I don't even know how to treat it. But that's him. He's just a jolly guy. He looks really bad. <laughs> Over in the next tank, we have Nico, my favorite fish i think i've ever had he was in my sister's 20 gallon i had to take him out because the tetras were nipping at his fins so i just moved him back here like two days ago so we're in the process of growing back his fins he's really pretty and also i have a purple mystery snail here i'm gonna move him out though because nico keeps harassing them i just had them in here before i moved nico in here just to keep the tank cycled so pretty i will do more videos on them in the future this is my setup i found this little shelf thing i forgot what it's called on facebook marketplace really cheap um i was scared it wouldn't be able to hold the tanks but the top was just fine bottom my dad added this little piece of support so it's actually holding it up really good uh -huh. I'll go on it to be in the video. Oh my gosh! Show the ring. <laughs> well, cause engaged guys, that's a little crazy. Hey, Bales.